grade, while many students were preparing for their transition to high school, Julia Evans was being treated for lymphoma, a cancer that affects the immune system. 105 days later, she went into remission, but in March, she was diagnosed again. She beat her second round of cancer on July 17th, her positive attitude never wavering. It's hard because it was a relapse, so it was just kind of just a really big flashback of what happened before, but it was a lot better this time, and because I've had a positive attitude this entire time throughout all of it. Her positivity really pushed her through this time. And she just always had a smile. Whenever I wanted to take a picture, I didn't get the, no, mom, I got of course. And she'd give me this beautiful smile. But it's like, I know some days it was really hard to do that, but she still did it. Julia channeled her struggles with cancer into creating the Julia Strong campaign. Um, I saw a bunch of nurses who had t-shirts on for other patients. And I was just kind of like, hey, it'd be a really cool idea if I had shirts too. And it was just kind of like a way to show support and also bring awareness to childhood cancer. It was something so simple but something so powerful that she she spent several days making it just how she wanted it to be and to see her just focused on that took a lot of the, I think a lot of the anxiety and pain away from the chemotherapy and then to see the nurses order them and then wear them and teachers wear them it just she knows she's loved and supported and I think that's really important for her. Support for Julia has come in unexpected places. Like we were at the Toledo Zoo. I had the shirt on and somebody else who had bought the shirt came up to me and she's like, hey, are you Julia? And I'm like, yeah, that's me. And it's just really cool to know that even in Toledo, people recognize the shirt and were able to be like, yeah, I bought one. It's really cool. Even though Julia is in remission, she still draws from her supporters. Even though Julia looks fabulous. She looks great and she's feeling great. The biggest fear about cancer is the unknown. And her cancer did come back once. Who's to say it may or may not come back again? We don't know. So while she looks great, she still needs support. And she still needs encouragement and love and support from her friends because this is a very challenging road. For the link to buy a shirt, check our Twitter at Novi Cats Eye News. I'm Renee Boudreaux.